Hello everyone, Scoops here, another episode of Richard and Alice. Uh, the last episode we followed Alice to the grave of her husband, and uh, yeah, it was a, a tragic event. But anyway, we are back in the prison playing as Richard, and I can't remember what I'm supposed to be doing. You're still there? Good. Broken pole. It's not... There's a hole in it. It's had enough. I don't want to sit down right now. I can't remember what I should be doing. Let's click buttons until it happens. <laughs> no. 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 Oh. Oh, you're just going to hit it and it's going to flush or something. Yeah. No, that's not, that's not good. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Can I hit this with anything? Can't reach it. Is there really nothing I can do from here? Yeah, I know you're still there. Am I still there? Yep, I'm still there. <laughs> Don't want to sit down. Uh, can I do something on the computer, maybe? Uh, something? Schedule maintenance. Da -da -da -da. All inmates should be aware that at some point this afternoon, Friday, scheduled maintenance will be carried out on the cell lighting. Light? Yeah, lighting controls. Inmates may notice their lights flickering and in some cases switching off entirely. Do not submit a support ticket unless there is a prolonged issue. Flickering or loss of light exceeding one hour. No other system should be affected. Cleaning service. We are currently trialing a manual cleaning service uh, in which eligible prisoners will be provided with the cleaning products in their cells. Should you be selected for this trial, you will receive a message via email. Oh, hooray, we might be able to do our own cleaning. <laughs> We've already done that. Submit a ticket. Uh, type 1 tickets is currently down for routine maintenance. In the event of an emergency, please contact your in cell emergency device as detailed in section 64C of the Typhon Project Handbook. A guard shall attend to you shortly. Please note, abuse of the emergency device may result in loss of prisoner privileges. Wait, what? In cell emergency device? Typhon Project Handbook? First I've heard of any of this. That'll do. Is that what this book is? No. Any clothes? Hmm. Alright, I can talk to Alice again. <laughs> yes? Emergency device. Alice, when they brought you in here, did they mention anything about an in-cell emergency device? <laughs> no, well, not to my knowledge. I was pretty out of it, mind. I was pretty out of it, mind. <laughs> it's kind of important. Try to remember. Wait, why, why do I have to remember? Why can't you remember? Well, they never mentioned it to me. Honestly, I'm not sure they ever told me about it. Seems like a bit of oversight, don't you think? We'll try to remember back. Did they actually tell you anything about this place? Well, yeah, I mean, well, there's the infomercial, ah, uh, yes, the vacuous thing. What do you do if someone goes, something goes wrong? What do you do if there's a fire? Well, I imagine there are fire alarms, plus you could submit a support ticket. In a fire, Richard? Really? Okay, what if the computer broke down? What then? Tell a guard. And if there are no guards? There are always guards. Apart from now. Apart from now. Do you ever get the feeling they're making this up as they go along? <laughs> well, the infomercial does say this is a test. Fuck the infomercial. It's insidious PR spiel. Spiel? Spiel? Uh, an odious, empty reassurance that everything is safe. We're not safe here, Richard. Sure, if nothing goes wrong, if absolutely no problems crop up in the vault under the ground, then yeah, maybe it'll be fine, but we're expendable. If one of us dies, they'll know what to adjust to suit the paying customers later down the line. We are subhuman scum, murderers, and deserters. And we're going to freeze to death beneath the earth just so they can eventually, one day, Rich Fox can live free off of free of the snow and looting and the killing. Jeez, getting a bit angry. That's all we are, Richard. That's all we are. That's quite an, a bleak outlook. I'm being real realistic and you know it. Fuck. Handbook. Have you got a ty p Typhon Project handbook in there? I've never seen anything of the sort. You know what? I actually do. It's all the reading material they gave me. Can you pass it over to me? Just tie some blankets together like I did. Really, Richard? Am I not capable of just reading it to you? <laughs> oh, no, no. That's not what I mean. I just... I, I, I know what what I'm looking for and so tell me okay sorry I didn't mean anything by it it's fine let me go get it now this is having a bad day got it okay Christ look at this thing talk about blowing your own trumpet hey listen to this since the company was established in 1927 uh, UGPT has been the leading market force in meteorological disaster management solutions, eventually branching out into custom safety shelters and various subterranean physics research. In the 1950s, our technologies were embraced by many companies to aid in the creation of durable, withstanding bomb shelters. What a thing I have on your resume. So what do you want me to look up? Oh heavens, what was it again? Uh, 64C. Can you look up section 64C? One moment. 
All right, this seems to be an emergency device. That's it, that's what we need. In the case of emergency, please follow standard support ticket procedure. <laughs> You're joking. However, should this course of action be unviable, each suite has been fitted with an emergency device, which, when triggered, will alert the guard post. Note, misuse of your incel emergency device may result in loss of privileges. Yeah, yeah, where is it? Hold on, I'm getting to that. I'm glad you're so relaxed about this. Well, it's all right. It's all right now, isn't it? Um, once we set off this emergency device, the emergency what's it will be fine. Yeah, I guess. Anyway, it says the emergency device is located between, behind the rear panel of your personal vanity unit. Right, I think I get it. Yep. Oh, oh it also says in the case of a fire, the emergency device will be rendered inaccessible. <laughs> well, that's useful. Thanks for not on fire just yet. Thankfully. Hey, maybe we should both trigger the emergency things, you know, just to stress how much of an emergency it is. Good plan. Alright. Behind the cabinet. Let's try prizing this open. <laughs> nope, can't get a good enough grip. Uh can't imagine these things. No. Mostly empty plate. What could I use to how could I use the plate? <laughs> it's only a safety knife. Oh, perfect. Knife. <laughs> knife the mirror, please. <laughs> Sounds like a solid plan. Maybe a safety knife, but it could just work. <laughs> hey! It worked, it's open. Hey, Alice. Yeah, there's a button here. Do you want to go and check yours? Sure. I used the knife. Yep, there's a button here, too. Okay, are you ready? Ready as ever. Okay, three, two, one. Oh. No, it's just Alice. You there, Richard? Yeah. So, I expected more of more of a fanfare. Me too, to be honest. Still, it beeped. That means it worked, right? Guess we need to hang fire, hang fire until the guards come down. Well, since we're looking for a way to pass time, yeah, yeah. But I might get cut off. I doubt we'll have to wait long. Next part of oh, the story. Barney was well. He wasn't doing so good. Yeah, is it snowy out? It's always snowy out, isn't it? I mean, is it falling from the sky? I'm not sure, probably. Do you want to go for a walk? To see Daddy again? No, not today, sweetheart. Just for a walk. My head is achy and my nose is funny. You, you just have a cold, baby. You'll be fine. Maybe you should stay in today. Will you tell me stories? Maybe later, sweetheart. Mommy's got to do some things today. Like what? I'm going to try and find a way upstairs. We put it off for, for far too long. Hmm. Why don't you go back to bed for a bit? Okay, Mommy. Achoo! I haven't figured out a way to get upstairs yet. Sigh. It's not just the cold, is it? Fucking hell, Alice, think. The old man had medicine. Perhaps if I... No. No, I can't go back there. Not ever. There's got to be someone. Something to help. Christ. Oh, I'm gonna have to go for the polar bears. Maybe I should really check upstairs. There's that loose board on the window. I just need to find a way of getting up there. So it's way too high to reach. Shotgun shells, toy car, or a gun. Probably not. I wanna sit down right now. Yeah. Okay, so I'm guessing maybe you into the forest I have to go? I can remember everything around here. Can I try and climb the tree? That would make sense, kind of. It's a billboard. Yeah, good call. Let's try and enter the woodland. No better. Okay, so that's a no go. So I don't think there's going to be anything over here. No. I just need to explore until I find something. <clears throat> there's a shed down here, but I don't think there's... Huh. I can't imagine there's really anything else in here that I could do. But I'll give it a go anyway. Might as well be thorough. 
Lawnmower. Duh, 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 duh. Anything in here? No. Workbench? Probably not. Nothing to do here for now. Put a toy car on it. That won't work. <laughs> Alright, we're heading off to the right then. I'm guessing there would be some kind of plot point over here. sticks or anything like that, right? Dead animal, definitely dead, nothing else. Kind of getting snow covered. Oh, what's this? It's just bricks and a wall. Wait, what was that? Oh. It's my own items. Huh. Yeah, I don't really know what to do here. Can I go in? I should leave Barney to rest for a while. Can I shoot the window? Can I do shotgun shells over here? No, it's too high up. Um, toy car? Too high up. It's so weird. I, I, hmm. I, honestly, I do not know. That's just a billboard. And I, there was nothing else, right? Like, can't climb up this wall or go to like the right here. No. Hmm. Is the right sort of ammo, right? <laughs> huh, this is a pickle. Alright, I kind of, there's like an empty space maybe right in the middle here that I didn't see fully. to do here. Uh, unless there's like a tree somehow I can... No. Okay, wander into the woods. Could I shoot the gun? <laughs> or shoot the billboard? Alright, the only thing I can think of that I can really truly interact with out here is that dead animal. Can I, sh can I shove the toy car inside the animal and ride it up <laughs> no, <laughs> this is stupid. <laughs> but at the same time, I really don't know what else to do here. Yeah, no, definitely nothing useful. We're gonna shoot it. Why would I do that? Toy car it. Sure, why would you do that? It's a good question. Okay. It's a gun, empty though, so not much news now. A toy car, Barney gave it to me. It's a box of shotgun shells. Maybe if there's like an opening around here, I can go there. Oh, can I? Can I go over here? No. It just takes. It's just a woodlands all over the side, right? Yeah. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, I clicked something. What's going on? Oh, I don't know what I did there. I think I did that. Yeah. <laughs> I am definitely in a pickle. I don't want you to sit down. It's way too high to reach. So how could I get up there? Am I missing something that I could maybe climb up? Anything on the door frame? Leave Barney to rest. Wow, okay. I'm going to probably cut most of this. And, uh, hopefully get up there.
whoa, what was that? Oh my goodness, I didn't see that. Okay. This church has always looked so lifeless and depressing. I'm not touching that. Good call. Frozen can in bin. There's something in the bin, but the water's frozen solid. Shoot it! <laughs> I didn't mean to shoot yourself, you stupid. Piece of paper. Snowy note. Caleb, you're on your own, bro. I'm sorry, I can hear them out there chilling. Call it chilling? Foe me? For me? Why the fuck did Sarge bring his daughter to a place like this, man? Little brat. Guess she told daddy and daddy got pissed and they told the polars. I'm gonna go where nobody's gonna find me. And ain't getting old, Jake. Burn this. Get far away from... Hope you got my little gift. Alright, well, see if I can get in here. Lock tight, of course, naturally. Alright, let's try and get somewhere else. It's probably a side window or something like that I can get into. Oop, can I go over here? Yes, I can. Hmm, there's a box in the middle of the lake. How weird. Uh, I don't think I can really get to it right now, though, and I don't think there's anything else around here that I need. Ooh. Church! So I really can't get out there. Alright. Head back, then. Church bell's gone off. Oh, door's open. Ooh, this is tense. Hello? Anyone around? Guess not. Christ, this place is in good shape. <laughs> uh, sorry. <laughs> a little blasphemous. A book. Let's have a work. Readouts, it says. Hmm, pages and pages of arcane figures. Must be related to the machine over there. Wait, what's this? A few bank pages and a list of transactions. Food, clothes, medicine, and some horribly familiar shorthand. There's something tucked in the back of the book, too. A photograph? Happy families, huh? What an awful place to leave it. Machine. No, no, I'm not going to start tampering with unfamiliar machinery. Alright. Let's get up here. Um, there's a trap door over there. Confessional door. Electric lighter. Sure, it might come in handy. Ah, uh, ladder. Altar? Nothing I can do. Crucifix? I just don't want to desecrate this place. A ladder. Perfect. And it's extendable. Looks like it's rusted shut, though. Should I take... I should take it anyway. Shouldn't be too much of a problem to cart it around with me, right? A full-on ladder? You think it would be, actually. Screenshot! Um... Yeah, let's check out the confessional door first, and then go check out the trap door. Forgive me, Father, for I have... Oh, it's locked. Oh, well. No big loss. <laughs> Statue. What am I supposed to do with it? Okay. Trap door. Hmm. Looks unlocked. Maybe I should see what's down there. Yeah, that's weird. Is it locked from the other side? Weird. It doesn't look too sturdy. Electric lighter. Oh. Can I put shotgun shells in it? Can I combine the shotgun shells with an electric lighter? No. Alright, I already tried that. Hmm. It's very confusing. I feel like I should be able to do something there, but... Second ladder. Da -da -da -da. There's no batteries in it, though. Oh, crap. Alright, I already read that one. Shotgun shells. Right, okay. Oop. I guess this leave from here? I feel like, okay, no, no, no. This is gonna tell me, yeah. Forget it. Forget it! I should really get back to the house, make sure Barney's okay. Really can't get in there? Oh well. Huh, so that's interesting. Um, I guess I just have to make sure Barney's okay. He hasn't died yet or anything like that. 
Something's gonna happen here, though. Something suspicious. Still think that inside of here, there's like a stairway up to the second floor. And there's just like some rubbish in it. <laughs> some trash in the way. You'd think I could probably clean that out, right? Barney, Barry, Barney, where are you, honey? Oh god. Sniff. Barney, where are you? Hiding behind the door. Barney, thank goodness, buddy. Hi, mummy. Are you okay, sweetheart? Have you been crying? Nuh uh. Hmm, what's wrong? Cough. I missed you, mummy. I was only gone a few minutes, sweetheart. Did you have a nightmare? I heard noises. Uh, you just had a bad dream, sweetie. My tummy is hurting. We still have a little bit of food in the kitchen. Not hungry, hurty. Oh, Barney, it'll be okay, I promise. You'll get well, and we'll go on adventures again. It'll be great, you'll see. Did you have a nice adventure, Mommy? Well, not really, sweetheart. I miss you when I go out by myself. You're my brave hero, aren't you? Sniff. Yes, I am. Aren't I, Mommy? You sure are. Hey, Barney, does that r robot I gave you have batteries? Bat rays? Never mind. You talked about bat rays the other day, Mommy. It was funny. Hmm, so I did. I'm gonna give you the toy. Barney, give this to me. Bernie gave this to me. Bernie, he said if I tried to give it back. Oh, okay. Um, we'll get you better soon, I promise. I don't need to do anything with that. Is there something in here? No. Maybe in the radio? Radio had his batteries. Yay! Alright. Batteries with the electric lighter. Now with added batteries. Can I do anything with this, though? Um, I don't know what anything I need to look kind of light. <laughs> okay, light the cooker. I'm not going to cook that. No, of course not, you idiot. <laughs> I can't move it. Huh. Should I leave? I can't think there's anything else here. Uh, there's just a couple more things I need to do. Do you want to come with me this time, sweetheart? My tummy's too hurty. Oh, honey, stay here then. Get rested up. I won't be long. I think I can get it upstairs really soon. I'll shout down to you when I get up there, just so you know I'm close. So, I can't use this ladder, right? I can use the ladder to get up to the first floor, but it won't extend that far while it's rusted shut. Can I light it? No, I know that. So I probably need some kind of oil can. <laughs> of some kind. Um, I'm gonna go check the shed down here. This might be a, another extra long episode. <laughs> So there's that lawnmower. Maybe we could somehow pull oil out of that. Just spitballing. Getting an idea. Come on. And then head over to the church if there's nothing in here. No. No. Oops, I don't need to do that. <laughs> Rusted ladder in here? No, that's stupid. <laughs> that is a stupid idea, Alice. I don't even know why you did that. Okay. Time to get up here. No, 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 I don't want to go to the woods. I have to go up here, please. No, not into the woods. <laughs> I don't get how this works. It's deceptive because it's surrounded by woodlands every time we go up here. Okay, there we go. Oh, can I light this? And no, 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 I don't want to go. Uh. Go ahead, go ahead. Um, electric lighter. Frozen can. Be careful. Got it. What is this? Rust removal spray. Well, that's convenient. Perfect. Let her extend now. Uh, seems I used all the rust remove, though. May as well get rid of... Ah. Alright, let's see if I can kind of burn through the, the lock in this trap door over here. Probably can't. I don't think that'll work. Okay, cool. So what do you expect to find up in the uh, second floor? I'm thinking bodies. I don't know about you guys. <laughs> More bodies. More bodies. Just kind of seems like the thing that'll happen. Alright, extendable ladder up to this one. Okay, here it goes. 